were an average alien family living on their own planet. And we were an average family living on ours. It's about more than friendship. It's about adventure. Mac and me. Trample on snakes. I think that's something we can all connect to. Victoria's B.I.G.'s crown is going up for auction, and the rap legend wore and signed the crown in the iconic 1997 King of New York photo shoot for Rap Pages magazine. And Notorious B.I.G. was shot to death just three days later. The Biggie Smalls crown photo went on to become one of hip-hop culture's most recognizable images. And auction house Soft Spees wrote on Twitter that the 90s rap artifact would be auctioned on September 15th in New York. Auction House Sotheby's wrote on Twitter that the 90s rap artifact will be auctioned on September 15th in New York. The live auction will include many other items with more than 120 lots. It pays tribute to hip hop's history and cultural impact. There are several highlights. Uh, the big, big one is Biggie's crown, which was the crown that he wore for that famous photograph that was done of him depicting him as the King of New York. So we've got that straight from the photographer to the portrait. The sale price was double the $200,000 minus $300,000 estimate. A sealed 12-inch copy of one of hip-hop's foundational tracks, Beat Bop by Ramelzy vs. k Rob, released in 1983, sold for $126,000. So rare. When we visited Basquiat's downtown studio, we talked about the content of one of his recent canvases and gained new insight. Go, go through, what, what's this? Pluto. It's, it's based on a, a drawing that was the first drawing of the moon by Galileo. Ah, and so this is actually an image of, of the moon there. No, actually it's, an image, actually, it's an actual image of the moon. No, it's based on a drawing of the moon, but it's an image of Pluto. Yeah. This looks like an eye. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, the, that's the evil eye of the Malocchio. Oh. And, uh, and below there, what, what, what's this bell? That, 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 that's a Roman bell buckle. This, is, this says parasites. Parasites? Yeah. And uh, what, why'd you... What, par parasites meaning people? No, or, meaning, 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 meaning parasites. Meaning parasites. substance and it has these hands sticking out all over the place. And I think um, Jim liked the idea of the shaft of hands and he suggested that hands actually should just form faces. Probably can be done.
want to reveal the truth about how K Rob versus Grand Z came about. So, John gives me a piece of paper. And Ram comes in, the legendary Ram Mel Z. So, John gives, gives me a sheet of paper and gives Ram a sheet of paper. And we go in the room. And I guess it's on this piece of paper, he wants me to say certain things and want Ram to say certain things. So, what was crazy. Me and Ram looked at each other and I balled it up. It was like. centuries after their work because they created their own worlds. They created their own universes and their own languages and that is exactly what we have behind us here. Rommel Z was friendly with Basquiat. He was rapping. So he was really enmeshed in that whole cultural context. Trample on snakes, straight up fucking mind control, implanting in your subconscious. Another former New York graffiti sprayer is Ramel Z. He creates striking and more than a little edgy performance art in self-made street art costumes. I walk down the street, people look at me and say, who the hell are you? For his artworks and public performances, Ramelzy has created a personal mythology of his own gods, based on science fiction, horror, and even quantum physics. I am one of the gothic futurists in the Alpha's Bet, of the equation known as the Ramelzy. I am some 16 billion years old. The particular person I'm acting out right now has a theorem that if he can boomerang through time, he can make sure that a sledgehammer causes a cosmic flush. As for the rest, Crux the Monk, Alpha Positive, Destiny and Destiny, Win the Mother of Natures, Igniter, the Master Aphrodite, he's a judge, and a secretary known as Vane the Insane. A maitre d' known as Chase of the Eraser. You have the Gashalier, just like on my t-shirt. Everyone calls it the Ram LZ because it's the one that's the main character. You have uh, Reaper Grimm. You have a pimp known as Barshaw Gangstar the Duck. 
Oh, yeah. And uh, Chimer is a bookie. He takes bets. Ramosi's costumes, paintings, and art objects are made from throwaway materials found in New York's skips. His recycled street works are collector's items for New York's cashed up hip hop stars. Whose game you're dealing? Whose cards you feeling? Found all my demons. Ramosi sells paintings, customized skateboards, and clothing items to street fashion brands like Supreme. Whose owner made the pilgrimage to Ramelzi's Mystic Street Art Workshop? The guy called me on the email, said he liked my work, I'd like to do something with me. I said fine. You get a deal, end of deal after the first deal. He came, he bought. He didn't know what he was getting into. I didn't know what I was getting into. He looked around. We had a good time. He bought more. He bought more. <laughs> then he kept buying more. <laughs> What do you do? Ladies and gentlemen, you know, the captain has turned off the no smoking sign. As a reminder, smoking is permitted only in rows 21 through 33. May 10th. Thank God for the rain, which has helped wash away the garbage and the trash off the sidewalks. I'm working long hours now, six days a week, sometimes seven days a week. It's a long hustle, but it keeps me real busy. Hey, Ram, what is your philosophy of life, Ram? Live until you're dead. What does it mean? Breathe well, deep, and lick them long if you're a girl. <laughs> and if you're not, hit hard, fuck them deep. First of all, Ramel Z is my enemy. I am not Ramel Z. I am Crooks the Monk. Stargazer, puzzle master of time itself. Get the message. Next question. Yes. Okay, I'm, pardon me, I'm just, you know, Jamaica, just right. trying to, you know... Well, stay, I, stay with you because yeah, I'm like. I drink some, 40s. Oh, 40s. Mm -hmm. uh, all yeah. right. That's good. I mean, if that's your style. That's uh, my hey, style. Hey, yeah. hey, it's I'm good. slurring it just like every tree that did it. Okay. Get the slang. Get the slang. Yeah, tree. Yeah, yeah. I'm with you. I'm with you. You got me right here. Right <laughs> Ramel Z, y'all. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Listen, so, I'm out. <laughs> no, no. Don't leave yet, yeah, man. You can't leave. We still got time. No, no, no. I, I no. can't be talking like this on the mic. No, you got to keep it going. We don't have you here Listen too many to the times. DJ. <laughs> no, that most deaf. Most deaf. DJ Abe's definitely got well, it going well, on. You know, one of the best parts I love about going and rhyming is that every time I wear a costume, they never know what I'm actually going to wear. I could be a maitre d', like I said, with Chase the Eraser with Bambada. And you might not hear Bambada for another 10 years. His costume, Grandmaster Flash's costume, and my costume will be put in a museum in Seattle. So these things will be, you know, just mortified. Seattle, <laughs> Seattle there's a museum that's actually taking care well, of Well, a part of Bill Gates is supposed to be actually making this new museum. And they already got those costumes. They're oh, still trying cool. to get mine. But I think they'll be very happy once I de-missilize it. Oh. Oh. 
Let's okay. get the slang. All the Sprite ads that have been coming up, how do you feel about that? I mean, with Wild Style and all of that being the Hey, the, Legs the do what he does. Legs does what he does. But you, you just keep in mind that there's prey and spray. True. Okay, and that means the monks always knew about it. I am out. Okay. <laughs> But that was Ramel Z, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed it. You know what I'm saying? Um, a lot of times, the youth just doesn't understand where these heads are coming from. But you got to keep your mind open because uh, there's a lot that we can learn from people like this. So um, stay tuned. Keep the burners going. Keep the rhymes uh, flowing. And uh, if there's anything else you can say out there that has uh, more intellectual cap capacity, please try to do it. Because you know, we need some more of that. We can't keep having kids uh, keep thinking it's all about either blasphemy or anti-religion or even anti-pop. It should have some other type of flavor than just being, I might as well say, just a black movement. There's more to it than that. Saturn, we're gonna take a journey. Saturn, come on and take a journey. To Saturn, on to take a journey to Saturn.